Hello guys, in this video, I will show you guys an easy way to use multiple monitors in your CPU. Nowadays, people are using HDMI ports for monitors. Most of the GPUs have only one HDMI port, but you need two HDMI ports to connect two monitors. Of course, there are other ports you can find in your GPU like VGA and DVA port, but for that, you may need an extra adapter and stuff that cost you extra money. So, I will show you guys an easy solution. If your CPU has one HDMI or VGA, use those ports to connect your second monitor to your CPU. It's like this, no matter what port you are using, all you need is cables. Like I have one HDMI in my CPU and another HDMI in my graphics card, I have two HDMI cables. So I connected those cables to my two monitors and I also connected one of my HDMI cable to my motherboard HDMI and another HDMI cable to my GPU HDMI port. After connecting those cables, when I turned on my computer and the second monitor still didn't work. Because we need to do another important step. You see, our BIOS will automatically disable our CPU's onboard graphics when we insert a graphics card in our CPU. So we need to enable that onboard graphics manually from our BIOS. That will enable dual monitor mode in our CPU. Now we can use our CPU display port and graphics card display ports at the same time. BIOS settings interface and the options might be different from each company, but the feature that we are enabling is still the same. Once you enable that feature, save the settings and then restart your PC. Once your computer put into the operating system, the driver needs to be installed. Mostly the drivers will be installed automatically on your Windows PC. But in some rare cases, you may need to install Clipset drivers manually. You can download those drivers from your motherboard's company website. Or you can google your motherboard's model name with the driver that you are looking for and download it and then you can install it. So I hope this helps you guys, if you guys have any doubts tell me in the comments below. I'll try to reply and help you guys out. I wish to have that YouTube award for so long, it's been so many years. To get that YouTube award, I need to have 1 lakh subscribers. So please subscribe to my channel so I can have that award. And thank you so much for doing that guys. And I will see you guys in the next video and bye.